To begin with, vaginal secretions are generally acidic and hostile to sperm. Those sperm that survive must ascend the cervical canal which leads to the interior of the uterus. This canal is normally closed by a plug of mucus. For most of the cycle, this plug too is hostile to sperm and only for a few days around the time of ovulation does it change to allow sperm to swim up through it. Many sperm fail to survive the journey through the cervix of the uterus and probably only around one in a hundred reach the uterine cavity. The onward movement of the surviving sperm through the uterine cavity to the lower ends of the fallopian tubes is accelerated by contractions of the uterus. In this segment of the journey too, the sperm have a high mortality rate. In fact, only around 1 in 2,000 of those sperm which reach the uterus are able to gain entry to the fallopian tubes. Meanwhile, the egg is traveling in the opposite direction, descending the tube in the direction of the uterus, assisted by movements of the cilia.